See that heel? The, the live heel is probably back about here, but this part has just twisted around to the outside, so I gotta get it lower. Hi, Dennis here at Capital Training Shoeing, and we're here shoeing a founder or trimming a founder donkey today. You know, this this happens sometimes that animals are running out and, and the you don't pay attention to them, and then all the second, that next thing you know, their feet are way out of kilter. So it's just a matter of, of getting in there and getting stuff out of the way here so we can get back to live tissue. All this stuff out here, there's no life in it. So it just curls over and grows out. It's like having fingernails out to here. <laughs> so I'm just getting pretty aggressive here and just going at this toe and getting rid of it quickest way I can. Waiting on this donkey right now. He started to started to uh, to move a little bit. <clears throat> and once in a while we'll see a red pocket like showing up here <clears throat> that's that's why i foundered animals abscess so much because when the lamini stretches away from the foot sometimes it'll leave a little little blood pocket there and then that that blood pocket can uh, cause an abscess curling out over the frog just digging in here in the middle to see if I can get down to somewhat of live soul we're a long way from live soul yet that's a nice chunk came out easy back I'm getting back here where I can benefit from cleaning out just a little bit. Get that frog trimmed back a little bit. See if I can. Got it. See that heel? The, the live heel is probably back about here, but this part has just twisted around to the outside, so I gotta get it lower. Okay, time for me to take a break. <laughs> we're gaining, but we're a long way from there yet. So the, this part here that's sticking up, I'm gonna go ahead and just get that off here. Because live tissue is probably back about here. So I know I got, I got quite a ways to go yet.
So all that I'm cutting off right now is just distortion. I'm not this animal was when this foot was short was probably allowed to be too long out here on the outside which we would call that being lateral high and the foot goes towards length so the foot started an initial distortion going towards length and then it just progressed into more and more and more Now I'm getting closer to sensitive tissue, so I got, I'm going to have to go cautiously now and see if I can get fairly close to a normal foot. I'm going to let him have that. See if I can finish that up out, out here with the raft. front means so I'm not gonna grass it with him there. I'm gonna just hold it here. here is on purpose completely unloaded this inside heel so it can relax by not having any pressure on the ground and hopefully come back straight if that continued to carry the load like it was it would never Chalky like
see the nipper. Trim that toe off there on a bit of an angle so I can leave some mass on the bottom of the foot and still get that help it be a little easier for this animal to come over his foot so anyway that's a I think about all we can do we can dress it up make it look a little prettier on the outside but to go from that to that that's a pretty drastic <laughs> pretty drastic transformation here in, in a trim